A family dog is recovering tonight after its family says it was shot by a Hamilton County deputy for no reason. News Channel 9's Betsy Golden spoke with the family and has the details on what they say happened. Betsy. Well, Kim, the deputy responded to the home on Tuesday morning because of an argument between family members. When the officer got there, the fight had already been settled, but what happened when the deputy arrived started an entirely new fight. This is the Cooey family sitting on their front porch the same way they were Tuesday morning when the Hamilton County deputy pulled into their driveway. Raymond Cooey says when the deputy arrived, the family argument had already been resolved and that before any words were exchanged, the deputy got out of the car with his gun drawn. He opened his door and my dog was about three foot in front of me. He pointed the gun straight at me, dropped it down to the dog and shot. The deputy hit the seven-month-old lab boxer mix named Tojo in the chest near his shoulder. Raymond says the dog ran off into the woods, his family sitting on the porch watching the whole thing unfold. When the gun went off, fire came out of it, and I'd, actually I didn't know if he had shot the dog or my husband. It was the dog, and they say it could have been much worse killing him. Or somebody. That, that's the worst part of it. Officials with the Hamilton County Sheriff's Department released a statement today saying the deputy was confronted by a dog running towards him in an aggressive manner. But Raymond disagrees. And the dog was not barking. He was wiggling his tail standing in front of me. Cooey does say that several officers arrived and helped him find his injured dog and that they were able to get Tojo to the vet in time to save his life. He has gone back to the vet each day since to have his bandages changed and wounds cleaned. And the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office says they're treating this like any other incident where a deputy discharges a firearm. The Internal Affairs Division is conducting an investigative review, and that's currently ongoing. They are also covering the dog's medical bills.